Hello, my name is Valerie Bowling, and I am the author of Together We Ride. As I said, I am the author of this book, which means I wrote the words, but the illustrator is Kehlani Juanita, and this book is published by Chronicle Books. I got the inspiration for this story actually during the COVID shutdown. My husband and I were taking walks every day in our neighborhood and we saw so many children out riding bikes. And there was one little girl in particular who was four years old who had learned how to ride a bike, which is a little young for learning how to ride a bike without training wheels. But she provided the inspiration for this story. And then I also said, I want to see how few words I can use to tell a story. So Together We Ride is only 30 words and all of the words rhyme with the word ride. All of the end rhyme, we call it. The last word in each line rhymes with ride. There's just one exception though. And when you read the book, you can see if you can find that. But I'm going to read a bit of the book to you now. And I will start by reading my dedication because the book is dedicated to you. For every child who's learned to ride a bike and for those who will one day learn. And Kehlani, the artist, also wrote a dedication and hers says to all the Black fathers who are beacons of love, protection, and unconditional acceptance. So now I'm going to read Together We Ride. Inside. You can see that they are inside the garage getting ready to go for a ride. Outside. And I often ask, readers what they think this is, because some people think this is a pool, but it is actually the road. It is the road in the neighborhood. It's actually called a cul-de-sac. It's that circular ending at the end of some streets. Slow guide. Starting out slowly and then Quick stride, dad has to walk quickly to keep up with her. Uh oh, slip, slide, tossed aside. That can happen sometimes when we're just learning how to ride a bike. Hug, pride. Dad is there to offer comfort, make her feel better. Here's dry, decide. What is she going to do? Do you think she is going to get back on the bike and continue riding? Do you think she's going to say, forget this bike riding thing, I never want to do this again? Or maybe she'll say, you know what? I've had enough for today, but I'll try it again another time. So you're going to have to read the book to find out what she actually decides to do. I hope you enjoy this book. And the reason I want you to read it is because I want you to get outside and ride your bike or do whatever you like to do outside. It's important to be outside in the fresh air and move around and get exercise. It helps not only our body, but our minds. And so it's just, it's great. You can be outside with your family, like this little girl is with her dad, but you could be with your friends. You could be with siblings. You can be with whomever you would like. So I want you to do that. And I also want you to think about what it's like to learn something new. 
this girl is learning how to ride a bike. And it's not easy when you're learning something for the first time. But I want you to think about what's something that you might like to learn. And I'd like for you to try that. And the other reason I hope you'll read this book and like it is because there is a sequel to the book. As we see, we have a little girl learning how to ride a bike with the support and love and guidance of her dad. And we also have Together We Swim. And the mom in the same family is teaching the younger brother how to swim. So if you like Together We Ride, you can also read Together We Swim. Both of these books are written by me and illustrated by Kehlani Juanita and published by Chronicle. Thank you so much. And I hope you will love, learn, and laugh and enjoy the ride.